south park gonna have myself a time friendly faces everywhere humble folks without temptation going down south park gonna leave my wolves behind and we're parking day or night people spouting how to never heading on up south park gonna see if i can't unwind come on down south park and meet some friends of mine Cockman, you have to help us with the project this time. I did the project last time. If I never had the flashback you We are not waiting for you to have flashback retard. <laughs> You're going to help us research this entire assignment. I'm sorry, Kyle. I'm confused. Is that before or after you have <laughs> The people are training on us. The economy is failing. There's no way people will actually think this communist manifesto is doing it something. Men, men, I just heard people talking about how much better the country would be if no one owned private property. So what's one or two people? More than that. Near the entire group. And people were listening. Okay, calm down. There's nothing to worry about. We have the most control over the population. We aren't any in danger of changing. Plus, as long as we ignore them, we don't have to worry about all the goods being stored equally. Why would people listen to that, Marx? If he wasn't already dead, I'd kill him. Um, you guys might want to take a look at this. We would not stand for this economy anymore. Yeah! yeah. Capitalism has failed us for the last time. Yeah. yeah! Capitalism must be eliminated. Yeah! And then the Jews! Uh, <coughs> much? Okay, not there yet. <coughs> Friends, it's the beginning of a revolution. The Russian Revolution! Uh, well, actually, the Bolsheviks. Shut up, Kenny! <coughs> the May 4th movement, Cartman. Uh, I don't think this has anything to do with Star Wars. That's because it doesn't. It was a national movement. Kyle, May 4th isn't a holiday in America. It happened in China, dumb <coughs> What the <coughs> does it have to do with capitalism? It has to do with communism. Because Chinese people rebelled against their government, then Mao Zedong became the communist leader. Is that before or after they bombed Pearl Harbor? Wrong country! Look, I know he's up to something. What are the United Nations supposed to do about it? Well, we'll have to go through the war. But future child, if we go through the war, we could lose. Look, the speech was right. There is not a curtain in place. The Soviet Union is already a threat. Cartman is the biggest idiot I know. All we have to do is follow the Marshall Plan and help anti-communist countries. Tell us. What's coming, future child? Well, basically, we'll just make stupid American decisions. Stupid American decisions? Well, yeah, like forming the NATO alliance so the Soviets feel threatened enough to form the Wall Star Pact, fighting indirectly through North and South Korea, and even involve ourselves in the Vietnam War it has nothing to do with us. With the United Nations? Only the Korean War. But don't worry, Cartman can't change history no matter how hard he tries. Thank <laughs> you.